Peter. So if you're running this place while Mr. Lee's out of town, who's doing your old job? Uh, me. But I could always use more help. You know anyone? Actually, I do. His name is Miles Morales. Why does that sound familiar? His father was being honored at City Hall. Oh. I talked to him at the funeral. He's a smart kid. He's just having a tough time. I knew a boy like that once. I remember it helped to uh, stay busy. It might help him too. Here's his mom's number. Thanks. I'll give her a call. Hey, you haven't heard from Mr. Lee, have you? No, why? Just curious. I've got a few minutes before work. I'm gonna look around, see if there's anything else I can do to help you out. Oh, you, you don't have to. I know. I want to. I should check out Lee's office. Glad to see you're okay. Hanging in there. May said you were at the bombing. I was hmm. praying. This office is locked. How do I get in there? Quietly. I don't feel safe anymore. Huh. Never seen that room before. Whoa, what the... High voltage lines. What needs this much power? I understand, but the account number is in Mr. Lee's office, which is inaccessible. I will call you back as soon as I can get that information. No, I don't know when that will be. Lee's journal. A key. I wonder where the lock is. Lee did so much for New York. I can't believe he was hiding such darkness inside him. This is the ghost story Lee's father read to him. About a demon that could only be mastered through balance. That room I saw from the crawl space. It should be right on the other side of the shrine. Hmm, some kind of puzzle lock. That seems right.
What are you hiding, Lee? Can feel my power growing, feeding off my anger. Father would say I've lost the path of balance that he could never understand. The only way to fight a monster is to become one. Creepy. This is the folder MJ found at the auction house. This might help us figure out what Lee's planning next. Yeah. It's a burn room, wired to destroy evidence. Police had found this. Or May. Don't want to think of what could have happened. Now, how do I get out of here? Hello, Peter. Mr. Lee. I thought you were out of town. Did you find what you were looking for? Martin, you're back. You get that. Thank you. And heading off again shortly, I'm afraid. Just needed a few things from my office. You must have heard about City Hall. Yes. Tragic. Peter was there. He was very lucky. At an Osborne rally. I didn't know you were a fan. Well, what matters is, you are both safe. Amen. But the bombers are still out there. Who knows what they've planned next? Oh, I don't think you or May have anything to worry about. As long as you stay away from places you're not supposed to be. Well, I should go. When will you be back? When my work is done. Wait, wait, wait!
Watanabe. I finally got your evidence. Head to the Feast Center in Chinatown. What am I going to find? A nice lady named May Parker. And some really weird stuff hidden in Lee's office. But listen, he's got another attack planned. Where? When? Still working on that, but I think he's going to use something called Devil's Breath. Sounds destructive. What is it? A substance created by Oscorp. Probably a bioweapon of some kind. I have a folder full of info on it. I'm holding on to it for now. I'll send copies as soon as I can. Okay, we'll check his office. If the evidence stands up, I'll put out an APB. MJ, hey, just checking in. Peter, hey, can I call you back? I think you'll want to hear this. Wait, why are you whispering? Just in the middle of something. How about we catch up over dinner? My place? Oh, sure. I'll even cook. Cool. See ya. Wait. Remember how you told me about Lee's corrupting touch? I think I just saw it in action. How? Some perfectly nice homeless people just jumped me. The thing is, they had glowing eyes. And I remembered Yuri telling me something similar about the guard who released Shocker. So Shocker was working for Lee? Uh, it's all connected. There's more. But I guess we'll talk about it at dinner. Yeah. See ya. Dinner? Huh. What should I cook? Oh, hi, Doctor. How are you? Parker! Exciting news. Come by the lab. Uh, like, now? This is my defining moment. Can't wait to show you. Cool. Um, I've got dinner plans. Can I come by later? Dinner can wait. You need to see this, Peter. Uh, okay. Be right there. Wonder if this means I have a job again. Guess I can stop by. Just for a minute. Triple J, I used to think you were exaggerating the danger to the city, but after the city hall bombing, I gotta admit, you were right. A lot of people have been telling me that, congratulating me, but I don't want to. I would have loved to have been wrong. Better yet, for those in a position of power who have listened to me and done something. They didn't, and I'm not sure they'll listen now. Unless concerned citizens like you and I make ourselves impossible to ignore. Stand up! Take your city back! That's the only way we can ever be sure that justice will be done. That, and listening to me every day! Attention units. Hostiles are assaulting an armored car. Backup needed in the meatpacking district. Over. Hey, Doctor. Hello, Peter. I'll be just a minute. Wow. Look at all this new stuff. We really need to get better about organizing our work. Where did you get all this equipment? Called in every last favor. Took out a few loans. It's like we're starting over once again. But this time's going to be different. You've been busy. Just getting started. You know, until now, we've been looking at prosthetics from the wrong perspective. Why restore people to what they were when we can make them better? Okay, I think that should do it. You ready?
Everything okay? This is all your fault, Norman, you son of a... Well, I know who you're not voting for in the next election. Sorry. I uh, have a habit of making bad jokes in tense situations. <laughs> uh, it was a good joke, Parker. Just a bit of an overreaction on my part. No, D don't worry. Uh, why don't you take a break? I'll, uh, I'll clean this up and uh, get us ready for another test. So, uh, hope you don't mind me asking, but it seems you and Norman have a bit of a history. We were lab partners in college. Became friends. Decided to start a business. We both had visions of... Changing the world, just in different ways. Wait... You were at Oscorp when it started? I'm half the reason it's called Oscorp. In grad school, everyone called us the O's. <sighs> Add Corp to that, and, well... It is a catchy name. Well, why'd you leave? Norman became more and more obsessed with genetics. He started a project I considered unethical. And there was this... Anyway, lawyers got involved. I chose to leave in exchange for a settlement. But that money didn't last very long. I've relied on grants ever since. If this project doesn't work... Don't worry. It'll work. Uh, let, me, let me just fix this up. I'll brew some fresh coffee. Be sure to run a diagnostic on the control unit. Could be a short.
Oh, why don't you do the honors this time? We did it. Next step, neural interface. That's a lot of work for you to do by yourself. Sure you can handle it? Apparently not, judging by today's debacle. Because I still haven't found another job. My funds are still... I know. It's okay. Don't worry, I'll figure it out. What's a few bucks when you're trying to change the world, right? To changing the world. Call from MJ. Doctor, I need to go, but I'll be back later. Don't worry, the work will still be here when you get back. I missed your call. We still on for dinner? Dinner? Oh, yeah. I was calling you about something else, but yeah, we should talk over dinner. Offer still stands for me to come over and cook. Oh, really? Well, I like to take risks. I'm still out, but I'll grab some stuff at the store and let you know when I'm home. Okay, talk soon. All right, dinner at MJ's, no expectations. It'd be hard to screw this one up. Guess I'll just freelance for a while until she calls. All units, mass terrorists have been identified driving a box truck. Report came in from Clinton. Over. Demons in the front two cars. This bomb rig to explode. We need to stop them. Your stuff. There's a bomb in the truck. Gotta disable it. Oh, I get it. You demons have backup waiting just up the street to make me think I'm winning and then dash my hope, right? an interesting tip today. Remember that barbaric beast named the Rhino? Apparently last night he almost escaped from his cell in the raft. How, you ask? Well, no one there seems to know, but they assure me he's been relocated to a more secure cell. 
Now, I'm no expert on Supermax prisons, but isn't the whole point of them that there isn't anything else more secure? I mean, he's a 700-pound maniac with an indestructible horn. If there's a more secure cell, why wasn't he in it? Hey, MJ. All right, I picked up a bunch of stuff at the store. Can't wait to see what you come up with. Swinging over now. Prepare to be amazed. You're not gonna believe what happened. So you know that address you gave me? I went there. MJ. I know, I know, but wait. What is this? Just listen. This is the address Pete found. Men are all carrying firearms. What is this place? That office. Might be something inside that connects this to Lee. Need to get back there. Huh? What was that? What dumbass can't put their shit away? Bet it was happy. Almost shot a rat. Martin Lee's really paying the boss? Yeah. We built this war beast for Lee. Lee finances the boss's new venture. Need to get into that office. Hey! Who is that? What are they building? Is this all for Lee? Nothing. Someone there. I saw something. I'm gonna check it out. Wait! So what's the boss doing with what the money are they from this building? Lee job? Is this all for Lee? Careful. Careful. All that cash is going straight into grave dust. You tried any yet? Only samples. The boss is still perfecting the rest of them. Man. I heard Take something. It. Easy does it. What kind of vehicle needs tires this big? Where is it? I swear I left it me out. seen the 316 socket driver. That guy's not going anywhere. 
Maybe I can distract him. Hey, when do we get a new research saw? Am I hearing things? Hey, anyone pick up more beer after the last run? Some kind of office must be to my right. Who is that? Need to move careful through here. Someone there? Nothing. Eyes are playing tricks on me. <sighs> Yo, man. Getting jumpy. Why's the boss being so intense about putting GPS trackers on everything? Protecting trade secrets. Doesn't want any word on grave dust hey, we can have. I heard something. Still, Bill's paranoid. Those barrels seem important. Alchemax. Why is that Damn. so familiar? Bill's paranoid. Who asked you? Get back to work. What's in these? Boss, come on! We'll never notice! <laughs> Such a disappointment. And now I need a new welder. for Lee. Here we go. GPS trackers. What is Tombstone using these for? All right, boys. Time to move. Get the gear for my office. Time to go. Okay, I want to say don't ever do that again, but since I know you're going to anyway, here. Take a few of those next time. Nice. Thanks. You know Tombstone is crazy and pretty much invincible, right? Everybody has their weakness. Mine is... whatever you're cooking right now. <laughs> it smells amazing. The chicken curry. Uh, just needs some time to simmer. No dumplings, I hope. You're never gonna let me live that one down, are you? Nope. <laughs> the Great Dumpling Catastrophe. I still can't believe they evacuated the entire building. I know, and in January, too. <laughs> Your neighbors hated me. Yeah, they were... Pretty happy when we broke up. <laughs> yeah. So, let's talk about what you found in Lee's office. Well, Lee clearly has issues with Norman Osborne. Yeah, but, but why? I don't know yet. But his next move looks like it involves devil's breath, whatever that is. Yeah, I'll dig into it. So I was thinking, what if we teamed up? What, what, you want to be my sidekick? Like a uh, spider girl? Spider woman. No, woman. no, not a sidekick. A partner. Oh. Not again. Ah. Hey, it's your crime system thingy. Looks like a residential break-in. <laughs> Charles Standish. Hmm. That sounds familiar. Oh, Oscorp CFO. Wait. 
You don't think this has anything to do with Lee, do you? Sorry to cook and run. Did... Did you just leave your clothes on the kitchen floor? Uh... Where do you want me to, uh... Just a couch is fine. <laughs> See you later? Yeah. Hey, it's me. This curry is legit. So what do we know about Charles Standish? Let's see. Chief Financial Officer at Oscorp. Single. Known for his art collection. If Lee's after him, it's gotta be related to Devil's Breath. I'll run a search on everything in that file. Let me know the second you find something. I think Lee might be planning something even worse than City Hall. So, are we partners now? Cause it sure feels like we are. Partners? Uh, sounds good. Okay. See ya, partner. Police look like they could use some help. There's probably... Somebody was in a hurry. Spider-Man! You're hurt. I'm okay. But you gotta find Mr. Standish, fast. Those guys in the masks kidnapped him and forced him up to his place. He lives in the penthouse, top floor. Okay, sit tight. This is a Stop it, huh? So glad you're here. You can't find my car. I could have sworn I parked on this level. Ugh! <laughs> 
You guys work here too? This building is serious about parking enforcement. Fight! A for effort! The elevator won't work, they know I'm here. But maybe I can sneak up through the elevator shaft. Should be able to make it up to the penthouse from here. Keep your mouth Standish. Okay, now what? Enter your password. Tasa, Saba, Pierre Dicuda. 